so much, Dave. A former Ohio State diving club coach is facing felony charges for an alleged sexual relationship with an underage diving club member. We were there when Will Bahoney walked into the Franklin County Jail. This was earlier today. NBC4 Sean Lanier has more on the charges and what the attorney for the alleged victim is saying tonight. Sean? I did speak with the attorney of that alleged victim, and he says the family does feel relief tonight, but he did say this is the beginning of the process for them. As for the suspect, William Bahoney Jr., we caught up with him as well, but he didn't have much to say. No comment, sorry. It was the only statement no comment, comment, sorry. Sorry. from William Bahoney Jr. as he walked into the Franklin County Jail. County prosecutor Ronald Bryan tells me Bahoney voluntarily surrendered to avoid arrest. He's charged with three counts of sexual battery, one count of pandering sexually oriented matter involving a minor. According to the indictment, in July of 2014, Bahoney engaged in a sexual relationship with a minor who was a member of the OSU Dive Club where he coached. The indictment states sexual contact was made on three separate occasions. It also states Bahoney created a video or took pictures of that minor engaging in some kind of sexual act. And today, for the first time with the arrest, we see maybe there, there's a path to accountability here. Steve Esty is the attorney for the alleged victim and says this hasn't been easy for her. As a young child, when, when you've got that imbalance of power with a coach and an athlete and the, the child is groomed and ultimately sexually abused, what happens is, is, is they start to blame themselves and, and they, they start to feel shame and that's what she's going through right now. He adds he will continue to focus on figuring out what all parties involved knew, when they knew, and how it happened. The ultimate goal is to make sure this doesn't happen again to any other athletes. The Ohio State University sent this statement responding to the charges against their former dive coach, which reads in part, the university has taken the allegations about Will Bahoney's conduct seriously from day one. We have assisted law enforcement from the beginning and will continue to cooperate and provide any assistance requested by the Franklin County process. Prosecutor's office. SD adds the people in charge need to do more. The universities and the institutions need to recognize this and need to put safeguards in place. And Ohio State did place Bahoney on paid administrative leave and then fired him weeks after the allegations surfaced. Bahoney is expected in court early next week. Local for you in Columbus, Island Air, NBC4. Sean, thank you. We are going to continue to follow this story as it develops and we'll bring you updates on air and online at NBC4i.com.